in this video we explain how to measure or how to characterize a logic gate using two square waves so these are the connections which you have made and there are two diodes here and we are giving square 1 square 2 to the inputs and output is given to through inputs are monitor on a unit so now after making this we should start the measurement process so that first we go to electronics and choose the logic gates and then you you need square 2 so we have to set square on WG then make that give some frequency say 500 hertz there and square 1 let us give some other frequency say to 50 hertz so we have made these two and then enable A2 as well as A3 so it looks a little bit you know difficult to make out what is happening here and another a better way to do that is we just change these all these into 16 volts so that the waveforms become appear smaller so we have the input two inputs here and the output here now right so actually the input came here down just because we see we could move it here like this so we could we could place it here so that they don't overlap well. So now seeing this picture you know that the OR action straight away you can see whenever say both the inputs are low output is low. All other places it is high. So this is how you, you can very quickly see the effect of the OR gate. 